The Syrian army is making fresh gains against foreign-backed militants near the country's border with Jordan. The straddles are off. In the latest developments on the battlefield, government forces have clawed back nearly 5,000 square kilometers from the terrorists on the south and east of Homs province. The fighting has also left dozens of Daesh terrorists dead. The Syrian troops are blasting their way towards the strategically important region of Baida. The advance is part of an all-out offensive to retake the neighboring Deir Zor province, which is mostly held by Takfidi terrorists. Observers believe the Syrian army is also focusing its operations to secure the deserts of the country near the border with Jordan. Hajar operations is uh, uh, mainly aimed at securing Syria's desert, which stretches from uh, uh, east of uh, Homs and Damascus towards, uh, of course, the Jordanian and Iraqi borders. The Syrian army made it impossible for those terrorists in that area to connect uh, uh, the desert of Damascus countryside and Homs uh, with eastern Al Ghouta and definitely this is a very significant uh, victory. The army is also trying to recapture Al Bukamal city, which lies along the border with Iraq. Daesh has been using Al Bukamal and Qaim city on the Iraqi border to move terrorists and logistical supplies between the two war-stricken countries. Tensions flared up in the southern region last week when the U.S.-led coalition mounted an airstrike against pro-government forces in Baida. U.S. officials claimed the convoy posed a threat to its allied forces in the area and that the Syrian army seemed to be transporting militias to al Tanf garrison near the Jordanian border, where British and U.S. commandos have been training anti-Syria militants. Reports coming out of Syria suggest that Washington and its allies are consolidating their grip on the area for a possible ground invasion. The Syrian forces' rapid advance towards the border with Jordan is believed to prevent the U.S.-backed forces' possible advance towards Deir Zaur. It will also stop Washington and its under-the-command militias from invading Syria. A secure border without the presence of any terrorist groups in foreign countries which support them can help put an end to the years-long and seemingly unending crisis in Syria.